I have started getting some spam emails that are very clever because they are technically from Google, Google Drive, Google Spreadsheets, Docs, and Slides. And, but they are, even though they're from Google, they are from spammers who are using Google Drive apps like Google Slides or Google Docs to put a link that looks also like Google, but it's not. If I click on this link, which I'm not going to, it's actually a redirect. And I don't know why Google makes it so easy to make a redirect that looks like Google.com, but it's not. If I click on this, it goes to some spammers website. So I want to show you a simple way to filter these emails. And so, by the way, if you do receive an email like this, that's that says google.com slash URL question mark, whatever, and you don't know this person, um, don't click on it. OK, because it's going to you know go to a spam site, maybe a phishing site um, to try to get your information, your private info. So the way to deal with it is to set up a filter in your email software. And the filter to set up is basically to use this particular search. Quest, uh, quotation, google.com slash URL, end quotation, and then quotation, mentioned you in a comment, end quotation. And what I'm going to do is make it easy for you by, actu by actually putting in a link for those of you who use Gmail, you'll be able to click on the link below this video. Don't worry, the link is safe. Uh, that will bring you to a particular search. Uh, it will bring you to this particular search so you can find these kinds of spams if you have received any in your, in your email, in your Gmail. And then this search, you can, once you go to this search, you can then click on the, uh, show search options and then click on delete it meaning any messages that come through like this, delete it. And what I will also do is apply to five matching conversations and click create filter so that um, this way, uh, any future messages will instantly be deleted that have that kind of thing. Now, if in the rare case that you actually work with other people who, who mention you in a comment using the google.com slash URL thing, then it will also, um, you know, send those messages. It will also delete those messages. So, uh, you should do the search first. I mean, I have been using Google, you know, I've been collaborating with people on Google Docs for, uh, gosh, since 2000. So about 15 years. And, and I've been, I've had Gmail for all that time. And as you can see, when I do the search in 15 years of emails, and I don't delete any emails uh, except for spam in 15 years of emails, I haven't received any other email except for spam using the search. So it should be safe, but I do want to say in the rare, rare case that your colleagues <laughs> or your clients somehow use the google.com slash URL redirect in a comment, which is a very strange thing to do. Um, well, you could tell them to stop doing it, but, <laughs> but, uh, because that's what spammers do. All right. So I hope this is helpful. Um, and if you have any questions or any other suggestions, please go ahead and comment below, below this video. Thank you so much.